Hi guys, it is about a quarter to ten. We're on our way up to church. It's 92 miles from the campground. 93, something like that. Um, I didn't sleep that well last night. I don't know why. Uh, there wasn't any noise or anything outside to keep me awake. But I just didn't. Petey's filling up the gas. We're at Speedway because we get points. Um, that's it. The keyboard's back there. <laughs> There's nothing else to say. My hair's still wet. <laughs> nothing else going on. It's kind of cloudy. It's supposed to be cloudy and then sunny this afternoon. Um, Pete's got the camera hooked up in the motorhome. We have a camera that takes, uh, records the temperature of the motorhome as well as, uh, like, it's not really video, it's like a picture every two seconds or something. And he can keep track of it on his phone. He can watch it, watch the animals and hear what's going on and uh, see what the temperature is at the RV. I guess I will see you later. Hope you're all having a sensational Sunday so far. Bye. He reminds them, first of all, the importance of prayer. He tells us that we must devote ourselves to it. Devote ourselves to being in communion with God. You see, prayer is more than just asking God for something. It's not a Christmas list. It's also lifting up those around you. God because they're in desperate need. It is fellowship. It is communication. It is a dedication to the one who loves you with all his heart. Of course now I won't see any. We are seeing some colors starting that you know, somebody mentioned. Down near Harrison we, are, we saw quite a few. But there are a number of trees that are starting to change color. There's some beautiful colors coming up here that have started and we're only in August. So as long as we were going by the area, we thought we might as well stop. We only got some bacon and a couple uh, roasts. They had English roasts on sale for $3.29 a pound. So we just got a couple things, but you can't just go by when there's, um, you know, our favorite store. Whole New York Strip is $3.69 a pound. If you buy the whole one, they slice it free. Whole boneless pork loin is $1.79 a pound. They slice it free. Um, let's see what else they got. Ground beef, family pack, $2.69. Boneless chicken breast, buck ninety-nine. Okay, see you guys later. Bye. See all the colors, guys? This is our campground, and I told you there was a ton of color. Look at them all. It's only August, guys. August. Look at all that color. There's some, there's one right there. Beautiful day, beautiful sky. 80 outside. Look at over that uh, bathroom house, whatever. color. That little tree right there. Color. Lots and lots of color. Look at these all. So many of them are starting to turn. It's crazy. It's only August. That is crazy. There we are in our shady spot. We got trees on either side of us to provide us with lots of shade. And one across the road and trees behind us. There's our shady spot with the prison in the background. Very nice, this tree's providing nice shade. Yay. Okay, I'll see you guys later.
sat down outside with my lunch. Some bacon from Steve, some fresh eggs from David and Trish, and some leftover steak with sugar-free ketchup. Beautiful day. Beautiful day. I can't, I have to say, I am impressed by this laundromat. They have all of their instructions on top, easy to read. Um, they're all dig like electronic. Let me see if I can get a close up without standing up. Really clear instructions. The place is clean. Look at how shiny. Everything shines. This is an amazing laundromat. Look at those baskets. I've never seen those before. Restroom. We had so much laundry here that it was, um, or at our motorhome. At home, it would be equivalent to eight loads. That's how much laundry we've accumulated. Pete didn't have any clothes left, and I was getting low. So I did want the one load, which we have a triple load here, tans, grays, whites. And that will give us enough stuff to get us through the next couple days until we can come back and do the other loads. Crazy how much laundry we went through on three weeks. So that's, uh, that's our evening. I took a nap this afternoon for a couple hours. Crashed totally. I didn't sleep well last night, so I totally crashed. Sorry about the noise. That's why this place is so stinking clean. It is really clean. So um, anyway, we're down there with the basket in front, and I will see you guys later. Bye. We just got home from the laundromat. There's the prison. Looks kind of blurry on here. There, it's a little clearer. Actually, it's closer than it appears. Those lights are closer than they look in here. Anyway, I'm just going to go. Um, can't even see what's left of the light in the sky. It's about 9.30. And uh, we got lots of laundry to put away. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. I hope you all had a fabulous weekend. And I hope you all have a great start to your week on Monday. Take care, God bless, and good night.